Hi and uh, welcome to another Tesla Tips video. Uh, today we're going to be looking at reinstating the USB-C data port in the center console of a uh, Model 3. Uh, it gives you your joystick control back and also uh, the USB music playback via a memory stick in the glove box. Obviously I've got a 2021 December Model 3 which came with charging only. Uh, so this uh, this mod works a treat. Uh, so these are the USB-C ports in the center console. They're data on, uh, charging only. Uh, you need this tool to get the panel out. It came with a kit. Uh, it's a little bit fiddly, especially one-handed. Uh, a couple of little slots at the bottom of this panel it slots into and it pulls out. Unclips. And then there's, uh, I think there's three clips at the top. And there's the module. I fitted this. This is the replacement one I fitted in January. Uh, and we're now in May and it's still working working well. Uh, you can see there's two plugs on uh, this unit. One is data and one is power. Uh, the grey one is uh, data, which doesn't exist on the... Uh, the original Tesla module. Uh, that cable on mine, like I said, it's a December 21 car, so that cable was in the center console waiting to be used. Uh, here's the uh, the original, and you can see the connector is empty where the data connector should be. Yeah, that's the uh, data connector, the grey one. Like I said, it, the kit comes with a separate cable if that isn't included in your center console. Um, I use a few of these uh, Amazon uh, USB A to C converters. Now you can see it just plugs into the USB s slot. Then on the screen, you'll see miraculously the USB press that and I've got some random music on this uh, and some podcast and audio books so there's uh, all random sort of music on that so you can see what is on the memory stick yeah you're looking for that logo uh, just to uh, show on, on the game, so it's saying to plug in a controller into the glove box USB, but you can plug a controller via a USB A to C adapter. There we go, play game. So it, the uh, the car recognizes a joystick has been plugged in. Uh, so we load up Cuphead. Uh, it takes a while just to show the joystick working. Press any button, press a button, there we go. And up and down just to show it's uh, changing around. Hard to do something one handed. And there you can see it changing around. Very useful for um, little ones in the car while you're charging. And you don't have to faff around, open a glove box, unplugging, replugging in this joystick and the uh, USB memory stick live in the uh, center console all the time. So I also use these with a Anchor uh, USB A hub. Uh, it's non-powered, works fine, and I got these little right angle connectors. As you see in this on the console, when you plug the USB-C in, it sticks up quite a way. I was, I was uh, worried about them getting snapped off. So I know it's loads of adapters, but it works fine. Uh, now when it goes in, it sits flush against the, um, the side of the console. So when that's in, like that, it doesn't get snapped off, or it's less danger of getting hit. And uh, just to show it still works with a uh, hub, fingers and memory stick with uh, music and books, etc. on. And 
Oh, there it is, USB. And there we are, all my dodgy, tasty music. So, yeah, in she goes. Joystick plugs into it as well, not a problem. So, you've got music and joystick, indoor hub, into the USB C and center console, as it should be, really. Mm -hmm.